Spiritual awakening. What an adventure. What are you waiting for and what will it take? That is a very interesting topic to take a look at. The personality self, the persona and the environment that the persona exists in are part of a subject-object split, a projected image, a self-concept that was made to take the place of spirit, that was made to cover over the awareness of pure oneness and love and innocence. So this self-concept or this image has to be undone dissolved, dispelled, or simply seen for what it is, an illusion. And the journey into the heart, into the mind, to discover and experience the awareness of spirit, involves Allowing the spirit to exchange self-concepts as you grow in awareness, as you expand in consciousness, reaching higher and higher levels of consciousness to experience a state of forgiveness of simply seeing the false as false, of coming to this happy dream state, a state of perfect non-judgment. In Course in Miracles terms it's called accepting the atonement. This is the seeming journey without distance. A journey that seems to occur in the mind as you release false images and self-concepts, false identity associations and affiliations, and open up into a state of all inclusion, a state of non-attachment, non-affiliation, a state of stillness. So that is a synopsis of the spiritual journey. And no matter where you believe you are or what you believe yourself to be, the spirit meets the mind and the undoing process begins. Laying aside all thoughts of what you are, of what God is, all concepts of time and space, everything that has been learned. Releasing, holding on to nothing, sinking deep within. as you allow the mind to experience its true nature, all concepts are laid aside. All images of the self fade and fall away. Now, this experience on earth could be seen as nothing more than the call to witnesses. As you open to your purpose of forgiveness, your function of healing in mind, there will be many witnesses called forth. This is the way that the dream lights up. 
witnesses of love and peace and harmony begin to flood the mind. It's a convincing job and it works. Witnesses of love replace witnesses of fear and guilt and pain and shame. Witnesses of happiness and joy, of freedom. Sprinkle throughout the mind and the dreamscape. This is true escape from the dream and escape from linear time and space. Now there are tools and signs and symbols and mighty companions that fill the dreamscape as well. A Course in Miracles is one such tool. And now you could say there are many tools that have sprinkled the, the landscape of awareness. Instrument for peace, levels of mind diagram, movie watcher's guide to enlightenment, the doorway, Mystical mind training, and beautiful books. It's just a panorama of help that is arriving in many, many, many symbols. I've just enjoyed the, the books, booklets that have come through. Purpose is the only choice. One mind, awakening through A Course in Miracles, healing in mind. Unwind your mind back to God. Quantum forgiveness, the mystical teachings of Jesus. There are so many tools on the internet. And so many talks and videos and workshops, seminars, intensives, devotionals. Now we have next spring, May of 2017, a mystery school coming and conferences. Many, many conferences, gatherings, retreats, sprinkled across the globe, as it has been for many, many years. And we have these things called devotional stays, where you can come to a Living Miracles Center In Mexico or Utah, in Australia or Europe, and stay for a period of weeks or months or years, even years, in devotional practice of forgiveness, mind training. collaborative projects,
learning to live together, work together, pray together, meditate together, clearing away any darkness from the unconscious and daily living, expression sessions, nothing held back, no private thoughts, no people pleasing. So the beat goes on, there's lots of support in any direction that you look. And you are so welcome to come to any of the events, to apply for a devotional stay at one of the centers, to volunteer online or at your place of residence. Come join us, come attend a retreat. Try our 30-day free program on, on the internet. It's in English or Spanish. So many ways to tap in, to link in, to pray and ask for support and help. There's even a prayer and support line. You can call and set up a, a prayer and support call. You're so loved and so welcome. And we walk together on this journey. Side by side, hand in hand. Lightening the load lightening the feeling of any burden or heaviness, walking toward the light, our true self, the Christ, our spiritual reality. Such a blessed life. Join us, please. <laughs>